Distributed property of multiplication. <laughs> You guys are so cute. Okay, so we're gonna teach Lily something brand spanking new called the distributive property of multiplication. Spanking you. Okay, anyways. Um, Lily, four of six. Can you get four of the six, Rod, please? And Zoe get. Well, no, this is something different. Last okay. one was the commutative property. This is distributive property. Okay, now you probably don't know this right off, do you? So I'm going to show you an easy way. Can, Wait. You, can you put it up here? <gasps> you just did it. I know it. Tell me. 24. How did you figure it out? I know what 12 plus 12 is. High five! Woo! She figured it out all on her own. She broke it up into two pieces. And she did uh, 6 times 2 plus 6 times 2. That's 12 plus 12. Awesome. Go ahead and write the answer. 4 times 6, 24. She figured out the distributive property all on her own. I didn't have to tell her. Okay, how about 4 of 7? So we have 4 of the 7 rod. Right. So 7 plus 7 is 15? Well, how about if we line it up since you're not quite sure? Yes. Here's 7 plus 7. Put a 10 there, and what else is going to fit? So 14. 14 plus 14. Uh huh. So it would be 28. What'd you say? 28. Yep. And I'm thinking she probably pictured in her head this. And so here's 20, and 4 plus 4 is 8. So she got 28. Picking up on this fast. All right, four of eight. <clears throat> so four of the eight rod. Eight plus eight is 17, right? Uh, let's try it with the... All right. Don't it. 16. Okay, so eight plus eight is 16. So what's four of eight? So we have 16 plus 16, I guess. Um, 32? It is 32. How'd you figure that out? Hmm. 14 no. plus 14. Huh? 14 plus 14. You mean 16 plus 16? Yeah. But how did you know 16 plus 16 was 32? No, I and think she's saying 14 plus 14. See, plus there's 2 plus 16 2. here. Okay. And another 16. Okay. And then you can... See, you line it up under, like, or over top of it. So okay. we have a 10, 20, 3, uh, 30. That does work, but how'd you do it in your head? Well, um, did you do If you're not sure, that's okay. 40. But if you can explain it, that would be cool. I too. can't really. Can't explain, explain it? it? Okay, that's fine. You got the right answer. Go ahead and write it down. But I just forget about it. I 32. just forget what I did. Okay. Okay, this is a different kind. Eight of three. You get eight of the three rod. It's a light green one. Light green. Yep, you need eight of those. You can also count by threes, like 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24. You're right, you could count by threes. Um, let's pretend you didn't know how to count by threes, because some people don't. We're going to use the distributive so, property to do this. So we have 3 plus 3, 6, and then another 6, 6 plus 6, 12. That's the same answer as that one. Because 12, yep. 6 plus 6, six that equals 6, that equals 6, 12. And then those and two are the same thing, 12. 12 more. Excellent. So, yep, you just did the distributive property. So you just break three, it apart. 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24. You memorize the song yeah. for that? <laughs> awesome. I always memorize the song. Yeah, it's fun to do that. Okay, how about 8 of 6? 
Ooh, we're getting into the big ones now. Eight of the six red, so that's the dark Seven. green. So you can help her if you want. Okay. You got eight of them? Yep. So okay, split it in half. Or, okay, we can do it that so way. So we have four. 12 plus 12 plus 12 plus 12. Okay. So we have four 12s. We do have four so 12s. Or, what's 12 plus 12? 24 plus 24. Okay, so, so we, we have, have 24 plus 24. That's right, 24 plus 24 is? 48. Yes, that's the answer. 48. There you go. You can see, um, eventually she'll be super quick at this, but there's no need for her to do flashcards right now. Um, that would actually be not a very good thing to happen because then she would only be memorizing these symbols and not have an understanding of what it actually means. Using these rods gives her a clear picture of what we are actually talking about. We're separating them into the groups, and she, she will be able to um, figure out these facts for the rest of her life if she does it this way. If she just does flashcards like this, then she may forget when she's in her 20s and 30s what 8 times 6 is and not know how to figure it out again. But So since, you need the rats. Yeah, the tell them. Tell them. <laughs> So using these will um, establish that number sense inside of her, so she'll always be able to figure them out. Okay, we got two left, Sugar Plum. What on earth? <laughs> okay, six of six. So we need six of the six rod. Look at me, I have an odd Instead, Last time we did eight of six, but now we just want six of six. Okay. Now how do you want to break that apart? What's the easiest way? So we have 24 plus 12. Okay. So that would be... 38? You're super close. Let's try it down here. Here's 24. And here is 12. So 24. 24. 30. 30. 34 plus 2 more. Four plus two. Thirty. Thirty-six. There you go. Thirty-six. I Good memorized job. that. I memorized six times six is thirty-six. Yeah. Six times six is thirty-six. Okay, last one. Here's a great big huge one. Nine. Of the. Eight. Of eight. So, or you could do it. Uh, yeah. Let's do nine eight eight nine. Well, you know what? I'd like her to do nine of eight because I want to show her something super cool. Can you guys get nine of the eight rods? Okay, we have four. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. We have nine of the eight rod, right? So hold on, hold on, put them all together in a big group. I'm going to show you something cool. Okay, so we have nine eights, right? Right. If I were to give you one more eight, how many eights would we have? We would have ten. And what's ten times eight? Same as eight times ten. Eighty. Which is eighty. So, eighty take away eight. Eighty take away eight. Do you know how to do that? Um, Seventy-two. Yes. Seven. So that's your answer. Do you understand how we did that? <laughs> Whoa, that's a crazy seven. <laughs> I gotta have to erase the equals. That's okay. I can do it again. Equals. Equals. Seven. Seventy. Two. Two. Okay. Do you do you see how we did that? We wanted. <laughs> whoa. We wanted nine of our eights, right? And use this rod too. Yeah, we used an extra one because we knew what ten eights was, and then we could just take away the one eight. And then he walked on the dance floor. <laughs> <laughs> So, was that easy? What do you think? Yep. Yep. Whoa. <laughs>